Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Yaga. With me, the Nox. Oh, we last left off. We helped the Voidani the Voidanoi get a his swamp back. Hooray! And we've come back to the village because, well, sometimes I just want to come back to the village and just, you know, check it out. Pet, pet, pet. There's a lot of chickens here. Ghosts. And sort of a copex. There's no way to get over there, I don't think. I mean, seriously, there's no way to get over there. I haven't found a way across this whole game, to be honest. There's a lot of chickens around this place. I'm gonna go get a look for the sword. I'm done. Tell me, dear blacksmith, how is your arm? Do you want some ma magic? Maybe a charm. By look, be gone. Be charmed, blacksmith. What blessings do you need, blacksmith? Ooh, be charmed, strong. blacksmith. I love that. Anyway, I've we run around the village. We're not seeing anything in particular drop or appear. God is ever watchful. He will protect those that support the church. Uh huh. You know what? I'll God one. will surely smile upon you, blacksmith. Take this. It will guide you in your journey. I got across. Yay! Is there anything? Uh, what a blessing what kind of blessings would you like? Me. Hey, there's a lot of chickens. Oh, yeah, there's so many chickens. Like a chicken palooza. They're just everywhere. Pop. And uh, the whole event, I did feel entirely too set my time going. Ha uh -huh. Right. <coughs> we got more body. I'm gonna leave. The Vodnik is now at peace. So we've still got multiple pages here. I need some help. Magic help. Uh, avoid the noise. And hold in peace. We fill with magical items. I mean, we're not really seeing anything else for us. You know what? I think I've got plenty of level ups. We can do a lot of other things, to be perfectly honest. So, yeah, let's just go talk some more. Morals, of course. What day did the journey start? If I'm right, it should be Wednesday. With the midweek at this hand, Ivan can resist more hits. Friday is the right day. He knows it's best day for riches. Thursday, his body is at peak and he's starting from this day. No, Friday. F Thursday. Wednesday. Friday. Thursday. <laughs> Why do you ask this stuff? Why don't you just, just pick a day yourself? Yes, I noticed as well. Eh, uh, you know what, let's say it's a Friday. Let's get a rich day. Good day for me some money. Dedicated to Mokosh. Look how peaceful and proud she stands. Offer, pray, clean, 
Attack. I think an offering. You know, these are expensive, so I want these. Nothing happens. Perhaps she doesn't like me. I'm nice. I give you an offering. I like you. I hope you. Hey, you. Hello, old tree. You could help an old tree, couldn't you? What's bothering you? What's bothering me? Why? Take a closer look at my bark, my boy. I did not carve this myself. The loner who lives nearby seems to have done quite some ugly deeds in his past. And now he seeks redemption by spoiling my time-worn coat. <laughs> As if that ever made any sense. My turn. Motivation? I will look for him. Not done. Very well. I will look for him. As long as he's not too far. Put sense into him, please. I don't care how. Just make him stop. Alright, come here. You tree carver. Pay for stuff. Better night, night. Hello. What's better night? I was the wrong button for that. Hmm. Better night, better night, better night. Better night. Ability because it's all this target and keeps chasing you. And it's not fun. Fist of power. Fill the mighty fist of power. I think it's getting those things that makes them angry. I've forgotten half my buttons. The woman's that annoying. Not too annoying, but annoying. Let's see, it's enough. I'll hit the end at some point. Um, a little bit of a non-fight, to be honest. I just have to throw my hammer at them and make them go away. Mighty, I knock him out. Okay, what does my map say? I go left and a right. I'm like nearly leveled up. Oh god, no. I hate spiders, they are annoying little 
creatures. And we have some strong spider webs. Not bad in last one, wasn't it? Out of the moon! Oh! We didn't make a. We got bludgeoned! Hello? Fishing man. Leave me alone, beasts! I'm freezing in here! You can come out now. Your foes have been dealt with. Yep. Oh, there's a priest. Hello. Thank you for getting rid of those wretched demon beasts. I thought they'd never leave. Most welcome. Stay in the charge. Words are cheap. That was close. It is my duty, and I will carry it out as long as I am needed. Bless you, son. May you have bread when in need. I don't get that pay. Oh, well, um, could you not do... Uh, bless you and may you have... Devastating rock punches? A stone oven sits here. You know what, I'm just gonna give you a gift. You give me bread, I give you bread. I don't know if that means it gives me stuff or not. Oh, if it doesn't like my bread. I'm mean, more impressed that I actually, re actually, I do regain health. That's right, I got the vampire finger thing here. The vampire effect that keeps us. I don't have to aim at you, I just aim near you. <laughs> and thanks to the durability of my, ha my hammer, I get a lot of durability. Complex. You know, without this, we'll lose money every time you get punched malarkey going off. We are making bank! We are making bank now, boys and girls. We. Without the whole. Oh, you lose money because you got punched. Yes. But now I just gain a lot of money. I might be losing health, but I'm gaining a lot of money. And I will have to sell practically everything under the sun to get. to keep. Get, Pay for great upgrades. I'm not leaving my mind this. You're not scary. Ah, that might be the guy you need to talk to. Oh, that's just a weird the carved head. Well, it's in the middle of nowhere. Ew. Be gone, stranger. Leave me in peace. That no. is exactly what the tree wants from you. Time for me to carve. Many sins. Stop carving. I have seen many sins carved on its bark, and I understand many will follow. Shares what? It's what? Stand trial. No more. Share the spoils? Hmm? You cannot avoid true judgment like this. Leave the tree alone. The Tsar needs to hear. Leave the tree alone. None of your business, fool. I made it mine. Then I'll carve some of my sins on you and all. You're an idiot. I try to tell him. I try to stop him. I told him to leave the tree alone, and I even I was actually thinking about saying, "Oh, the Tsar will hear." I mean, he's carved a lot of sins in that tree. Ooh, I almost did not see this. A wind diamond. Thank you. Maybe I should find. That's a long. You know, it's just a long trek to go over here. Let's go back here. So, yep, I dealt with you, tree carver. I didn't want to smack him. He actually left me no choice. Well, the 
bandit will trouble you no longer. My thanks, stranger. May you age well. Well, thank you. That's all for saying have a long and healthy life. Stop over here. Oh, hello. What's this? I think it's a spotlight to take dick. Not on these. What we do with this. Yeah. Dick, 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 dick. Rare, but I found one. Nice. Now we know what they look like. Yeah, and just you know what, I'm gonna put a combat hammock on. Bear's doing pretty good. So it's a sickle. Ow. He hit me in the head with a shard. About three seconds before you got smacked in the back of the head with a hammer. It mule me out. Hello. You are back, blacksmith. Are you not tired of these mountains? Tell me, what's on your mind? I'll set your heart on fire! Sad without money. Don't frown. The world is unfair. I sometimes get sad about all the evil in the world. I wish we could all just get along. What about you? What would make you enjoy life? I only need more peace. You are travelers here. Look at that maiden nearby. She's been roaming my peaks for weeks. Searching everywhere. Yelling some name. Digging through snow. And then she found something. Some dead creature. And kept trying to dig for treasures. Until she was attacked by some stew hacks. I can't imagine how she's still alive. And now she just stays near that damned fire, and I can't drive her away. That fire has been going for days. And I'm sure that if it were to die out, the maiden would be cold and leave this place. She's happy without fire. I'll talk to her. I'll talk to her. Make her go away. Yep. Let's see. Let's out. Yes, this be the exit. I'll talk to you. Why oh, he'll try and talk to me again. Maiden! Hello, Maiden! Traveller! Won't you help me? I wish to leave here and bury my brother. You poor thing. What has happened to your brother? He came here alone. In search of the Golden Anvil. I warned him about dangers here, but he wouldn't listen. After weeks of searching, I finally found him, but by that time his body was already frozen. I wish to bring him home. He deserves a proper burial, not this frozen tomb. But the creatures in these mountains killed my horse. Anything to offer? How can I help? What can I do to help you? It's so cold. I'd like to leave and find a horse. Yet every time I leave the fire, Morosco the Ice King comes near. I fear what he would do if I left. I've heard terrible stories about other women frozen to death by him. The fire seems to be keeping him at bay. Morosco, about that fire. Maybe Morosco can be reasoned with. I'm too scared to try. 
What if I say something wrong and anger him? But maybe you can talk to him. Can you please convince Morosco to leave me alone? Uh, so, you like cold? If you like cold, why don't you stay here? What's waiting for you back home? Nothing and nobody. But I wish to bury my brother, and the ground's too frozen here. Please talk to Morosco for me. Uh, she actually likes the cold. She likes the cold, but she's put the fire up to keep you away. Did you talk to her? Is the fire gone? Oh, not yet. I'm working on it. Um, wait, what am I supposed to do then? Hang on. As one well, lost most heart, he's made of ice. I might have to take things literally. Oh, that's an anger motion. I'm trying to make him. Did you talk to her? I'm working on it. Might that's the wall not literally. Have you spoken to Morosco yet? Not I yet. haven't talked to him yet. I'll come. I haven't talked to him, that's a problem. I want to talk to both of you. Better leave and come back. Oh, I don't know what to do. Huh. There? Huh. I is now fully confused. Do I have to set him on fire or something? It is confusing, because I've talked to her and said, Ah, oh, I need to talk to Morosco. Morosco. But I talked to Morosco away, and he wants me to talk to her. Huh. Well, I'm confused now. So... I'm now confused. I'm a confused Demonox. Yes, I know we're currently 38, dude. We're trying to figure out what to do here, because I have no idea what I'm supposed to do right now. I talked to him. He wants me to go get rid of her. I talked to her. She wants me to go get rid of him. Or convince him not to do anything. Very confused. So, what am I supposed to do with this guy? I shall think about this in the interlude. So, until then, you're not standing next to you, Morosco. I, I, I have no idea what to do with either. It's confusing. You're not going to stand here, okay? We're going to stand here together and we're going to think about what to do. And that's for next time. So, until then, until then, I'll catch you all later. See ya!